This is Goku Sun DBC, and welcome to a new game review. And as promised, the newest Street Fighter game review, Street Fighter Alpha 2, for the original PlayStation. And I will be reviewing also once to get the Dreamcast info version in. And here we go. Yeah, sadly, about the load times, that's one of the bad parts about the original PlayStation. But I love the animation style that are in these games. Yeah, I mean, it's been a little while since I've played with Akuma. Now keep in mind, I'm not as good at the Alpha series since I only recently really started getting into actually enjoying the Alpha games because for most of the time I always played Street Fighter 2. And of course mostly the Capcom crossover games. Ah, crap. I hate you, Zangus. Ouch. But of course, one of the important things, this was the first Alpha game I actually ever played. Back in 1998, I believe it was, or 99, was the first time I ever played any of the Alpha games. There's good old Charlie. One thing I'll say is the story, even though sadly most of the Alpha series isn't even considered canon, at least as far as Capcom is concerned. You. Oh, no. you win. 
even though this game is pretty hard, I will say for the most part, Never let a chance go waste that you can use a hold. And now we go against Dan Habiki. Good old Dan. Which was a bridge for me as a joke, of course. Sort of joke, don't underestimate Dan, no matter what. See? Just remember the old saying never judge a book by its cover. Sagat, which uh, instead of seeing Tiger, he says Jaguar. Now this guy can be very annoying. Ouch, see what I mean? Ouch. I hate you. Just like his master, he's annoying. Face the God. They annoy it, one of the most annoying bosses ever. And it, he's tough in this end, Street Fighter 2, but dang, never face him on the original game. Good lord. You want to talk OP? Ouch, and he's already OP in this. Ouch. Ouch. 
The last guy is it's an old man which was a mentor to Chung Yi. And now we have to face Bison. The big man himself for Shadow Yi. Oh, shut up. Him and his stupid psycho crusher. for the final man. And dang is he hard. Bison and Cigar put a heck of a fight, I'll tell you that. But dang it, this guy is not to be underestimated. Never underestimate old carry old people in fighting games. You will be deceived and have the crap beat out of you. Oh crap! Uh. 
fucking stupid move. Come on, old man, die already. Not this time. finally beat the boss. Whew. I hope you enjoyed this review, though it was a little more competitive than I expected my review to be. But this is Goku Sun DBZ. See you all next time here in YouTube, YouTube land. Same YouTube time, same YouTube channel. Please leave me a comment, like, subscribe, call me on Twitter.com Twitter slash Goku Sun DBZ as well as at Google Plus. And tell me what you thought, and if you'd like me to do any more playthroughs for fine games like I did earlier. And also in future Street Fighter reviews, tell me who you want me to play with if you want me again to play with Akuma or somebody else. But I'll see you all again soon enough. Same YouTube time, same YouTube channel.